Hey guys, Rorius here. Welcome to another little dash of nostalgia on the channel for me. <laughs> today, literally today, uh, the Command & Conquer Remastered Collection came out, which is a remake, essentially, or a remastering of the original Command & Conquer and Command & Conquer Red Alert. I'll sh I should have the, like, launcher shown on the screen now. You get the either you can either launch like the default original or Red Alert. I played Command and Conquer and Red Alert. I originally played Command and Conquer on PS One. I borrowed it from a friend and I rented it from the rental store. And and later on, I would go on to play Red Alert Two and specifically Yuri's Revenge like to death. And I played Red Alert Three on the channel a while back. These games are my fucking jam. <laughs> I'm no good at RTS games. We're gonna play Command and Conquer today, by the way. Welcome to the electronic video agent oh. installation. It's uh Oh, I skipped it. Come on, OBS. Oh, I think it's I think it's not capturing the screen properly. Are we in? I think we're in. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's the Yeah, it's the first ever Command and Conquer game. I loved these to death. Uh Oh, it's got a mixture of modern and old. I'll, I'll leave it. I'll leave the settings the way it wants me to have it. But I'm so keen to see what they've done because apparently these remakes are really faithful. And another huge thing with this is that they've, they've got, they made this with the idea of modding the game in mind. So it should be really, really good. Should I do the campaign? I'm the curious. The Trade Center in Vienna was the 17th urban bombing in four weeks, blamed on Nod terrorists. I don't remember the story. The Commission remains in close session tonight following Nod terrorist actions in Slovenia. At least your mother tipped well. Oh my god, they got the old... Like... <laughs> uh, unforgiving wilderness. They re- or they remastered or remade the- New Tiberium Harvesting Methods Institute I think they remastered the- of Nod increased profitability by 49%. They remastered the old cutscenes from the original game. I don't remember these because I never used to watch them. Nod Tiberium holdings now account for almost half of the world's known supply, giving the quasi-terrorist group incredible leverage in the London Gold Exchange. On the domestic side... <laughs> yeah, like, I, I didn't... The Command & Conquer and Red Alert 1, I never watched the cutscenes. It wasn't until, like, Red Alert 2 that I watched the cutscenes and stuff. Of Tiberium. But I'm pretty sure these the are the originals, but they've just been Kong's second world AI enhanced. Impact summit. Mobius is expected to refute charges from the scientific community that Tiberium might be dangerous. This is surreal. I don't remember this at all. As the DDI forces take off in another non assault, the free world holds its breath. This is Greg Burdett, WWN, somewhere in the Mediterranean. Yeah, I don't know... I don't know if it's all just straight re re or remastered or enhanced. Some aspects of the video look like they're new, but then all certain parts of it look like they've been, like, via AI. They've been, um, like, made to look look more uh, enhanced, like more, more modern. Um, I'll stick to normal. I think I'll play GDI just Global for this defense initiative episode. Selected. Are you picking this up? Good. I know you need more deep background, but we're up against it. Nod forces have fortified this beachhead at X16Y42. Intelligence is still coming in, so we can't tell you a lot. But we found a chink in their armor. Commander Carter can sneak you and some backup forces on shore right here. You may get some artillery support from his gunboats, but this is mostly grunt work. Your mission is simple. Knock out all fortifications, eliminate all Nod troops, and establish a beachhead by building your base. Good luck. So, that was a lot of exposition, but like, told through like, 
just snapshots of the world. Command and Conquer, its premise is that we're in a future in which an alien meteorite, essentially, or some kind of meteorite from space, hit Earth. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I'm already in control. <laughs> the music! Oh my god. So, yeah. As I was sort of trying to imply before. Um, uh, basically. Oh. Uh, yeah. We're in a future where, uh,. There's basically. Yes. Oh, is this my um? Moving out. Upgrade your tactical interface way. Oh! <laughs> oh, so space bar. In oh, nice! I was wondering why it was so low diff. Um, this is my construction yard, isn't it? Uh, wait, wait, wait. Let's get these units. Yeah, get them in there. This guy's actually like a gunner. He's bad at buildings, uh, better at troops. Uh, okay. This is definitely like a thing I need to deploy. Oh god. Get back here. Attack it. Oh, I can't control this guy down here. Okay. <laughs> How do I deploy him? I don't know. Yeah, uh, <laughs> this is like a, a real-time strategy game. An RTS. But these, I never played like StarCraft or um, like the, uh, the, what's some calls them? Warhammer games? Like I never played those games. So they don't really hold any special place in my heart. Command and Conquer though. I played the first Command and Conquer on PS1. And then I played, we, we, we proceeded, me and my brother proceeded to play the shit out of, oh, this guy. Yeah, that's so cool. You can go back and forth between like the old style. Oh, that's cool. The graphics. <laughs> that's super cool. <laughs> it's my blog. So that's why this way it's like super faithful. Like this is exactly what it used to look like. Except with some higher def like UI. Yeah. <laughs> super basic starting mission. Um. Yeah. Uh, so I, I'm losing my mind. Uh, as I'll, I'll explain, yeah. So there's the GDI and the NAR. The GDI are the Global Defensive Initiative, and um, this this meteor that hits Earth, it has some sort of crystal on it. They call Tiberium, and uh, what they find out very quickly is that this Tiberium spreads. So you you put it somewhere, it converts material around itself into more Tiberium. So it like it spreads in like a Grey Goo style scenario. Um, and it starts spreading across Earth, but Tiberium is like radio radioactive, or it, it, it unleashes like a an aura of sorts that kills people or mutates them. Radioactive, you know, it's the closest way to describe it. Yay! <laughs> One GDI casualty, eleven Nod casualties. Um, and essentially the the Nod, what the Nod want to do is they want to spread the Tiberium. They, they think that the mutations caused by Tiberium is like the next stage in human evolution. And so they want to spread Tiberium across Earth. Uh, meanwhile, the GDI are desperately trying to stop the spread of Tiberium to maintain, you know, uh, old order. So the golden locations are the Tiberium, sorry, are the um, GDI held locations. Uh, oh, I can select an area to attack. Oh, I, can, I only have one option, <laughs> but... Yeah, and the the red sections are the nod controlled sections. And later games you have like they refer to it as red zones and green and blue zones and stuff like that. Red zones are anywhere where no one uh, humans can't live because there's so much Tiberium. And the blue zones are like safe havens that have been protected by the GDI against Tiberium. So the GDI are like the good guys. Oh. We're in Estonia. Military power, local militia. Yeah, the the Nod leader is like Good this. Good job with the beachhead, Commander. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Time to bring you up to speed on Nod so you know what you're dealing with. Yeah, this that's is him. Kane, the self-appointed leader of the Brotherhood of Nod. Mm. Stand by, I'll link us up. Condition critical. 
<laughs> He's old FMVs. But yeah, it's also. Uh, all nine forces before we lose our position. I don't know how long we can hold out. Damn. You heard the man. What are you waiting for? Oh, oh God. Okay. Lost. Oh, we lost the unit already. Uh, but now Building. we have. Now we can actually build. We have an actual structure. Yes, sir. Um, so I think this is the, the continuing where we left off. We stormed this beach here. Um, Reinforcements have arrived. Oh. Yay! Thank yes. you. I'll get these guys to safety. Yes. Alright. Uh, we can get this engineer. Can we get him to... Oh, maybe they can't do that in this game. Engineers used to be... Oh. Engineers came to... Um... How do I deploy? Wait, wait, wait. How do I... What's the controls? <laughs> oh. That's why D is power plant. Oh, weird. This is for if you were like hardcore. I feel bad, but I removed the D key from all those other things. Screw it. Okay. Yes, I'm sir. so used to it being D. Um, I get him like over here somewhere. It was, what is this? It is an MCV. Yeah, I thought so. Cannot deploy here. Okay, can't deploy it there. Let's try Moving and deploy out. it up here. Yeah, as I was saying before. Oh, there we go. Oh, okay, that's how that's how you do it. Okay, well let's let's reset the bindings. Default. I don't need it to be D. As long as I can just click on it and say like deploy. I don't mind. Um, yeah. So this is a construction yard. This allows us to build buildings. So now I can build a power plant. Engineers used to be able to repair buildings. Like if I had seen, I could send him into this building and get it fully repaired. Repairing. I can repair it manually as well. Construction complete. Yeah, now I can build a power plant. Oh god, the building's so big. New construction <laughs> Building. Unit reporting. Yes, sir. Okay. So what are we gonna do? Defend base until reinforcements arrive. Defeat all nod. Complete. Oh. Uh, let's get another. Let's get a power plant going right down here. Uh, just be absolutely sure that we've got enough. We already have a barracks, so we don't need that. Building. Get like ten more mini gunners. Ready. Um. Building. Unit. Can't ready. we can't build um Unit. medics? Unit ready. Building. Yes, sir. Unit ready. Uh oh. Unit lost. Yes, sir. Unit ready. Building. Oh. Unit. Yeah, now lost. we're. I'm probably gonna not do so great because. Oh. Did they kill one of the engineers? I think they killed one of my engineers. Okay, I've got these guys set to one. So as soon as I click one, I'll select all these units. Ooh, I'm not doing so great. Let's not get run over by the. Let's not get run over by this guy. <laughs> Unit lost. Unit lost. Building. Okay. I can't build any more tanks, so. Oh god. Our base is under attack. Where? Which building? Oh, that building. Construction yard. God damn it! They keep they keep building new units, but I'm leaving my units up there. Unit lost. Building. Unit ready. I don't have infinite money, Building. so I should act quickly. Unit ready. Building. Okay. Unit ready. Unit oh god. Ready. They're coming from down below. Oh, he's so Oh, he got squashed. Reinforcements arrived? Oh, nice. Thank you. Let's get this guy down here. Ready. That's right, civilians fall out of vehicles. I forgot about that. Unit ready. <laughs> it's kind of, it's brutal. Unit ready. Yes. Building. Honey. Unit ready. Honey. Okay, let's find their, let's find their frickin' uh, Honey, barracks. Building. Honey. Unit Do they ready. not have a barracks up here? Building. Well, let's attack their construction yard Unit then instead. 
Um, send us up there too. Ready. Oh. Building. Unit ready. Unit ready. <laughs> I really don't need this many units. Building. Unit ready. Unit lost. Not a problem. Insufficient funds. Okay, just cancel Unit those. Ready. Building. I forgot that in this game, the Nod and GDI Cancel. buildings look the same. You got it. Wait away, sir. Like in the, in the later games, they all have different different structures. And I know in Red Alert, they have different structures. So even just in the next game that we'll play in the next episode, even in just in that, they have different uh, structures. Okay, let's get a bunch of these guys to join them. Let's just actually just send them up. Won't send them to attack. Just go up there. <laughs> it's music. Can I build any more buildings? No. I like how these guys just aren't even doing anything. <laughs> okay, these guys are now number one. Actually, let's not even bother with those guys. Let's go over this way. Unfortunately, you can't tell them to all move together. They will. This guy will move really fast ahead of everyone. And all the foot soldiers will fall behind. <laughs> I love it. I love that you can just like jump back and forth to the old style view. Oh, it's so cool. Oh, so there's some. See, there's some Tiberium right there. My units, like standing in the Tiberium, will get hurt. Any foot, any foot soldiers in the Tiberium will get hurt. They'll slowly drain their health. Okay, where is this other base? Huh. Wait, wait. Oh, wait. Are the Nod forces that are just running around, are they the yeah. only ones still alive? Right away, oh. Got it. Okay, wait. These guys? Just stay there. I'll send this guy out running around. I have a feeling that those three guys that are running back and forth are the only, fa the only um, enemy units left. I don't have a map yet, but that's because I don't have the, the building required to have a map. Wait, can I just Moving squish out. him? Moving out. Affirmative. Moving out. Acknowledge. Squish Moving him. Ah, uh, oh, is this vehicle not capable of squishing? Yes. Maybe this vehicle we can't squish. There we go. Mission Yay! <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> yeah, I should mention. I should mention it again. I suck at these games. Like I was never good at at um. Command and Conqueror or Tiberian Sun. They're both, or, uh, or like alert or whatever. I was, I was always so bad at them. If I go into like the skirmish modes, I will suck. <laughs> um, but I got better late in the later games. Like the later games suit my play style a lot better. <laughs> Not so, uh, <laughs> complete, oh, bonus gallery unlocked. Complete knock out that refinery. Oh, but yeah, <laughs> and they got 68% leadership and 1% efficiency. Um, I don't know what that's for. I don't know what that does. Yeah, so I'm guessing that I now have the next mission. So I gained that area there. Now I'm, I'm slowly like infiltrating from the top, but they're gonna slowly take untaken land around here, and I'm gonna have to fight back against. They might even try and invade one of our territories, and I'm gonna have to take over it myself. We'll try to do this one more mission, I think. Let's go into this one more mission and see what it's it's about. I know I promised more deep background on Kane and Nod, but there'll be time for that later. Mm. Carter says you hit the ground fighting. Nice job. Now <laughs> Thank we need you. that again. Somewhere in this section is a Nod base. It's protected against airstrikes by Nod SAM sites. Knock them uh, out so Colonel yes. Morelli can provide air support. That should make it easier for you to take out the base. Some of these missions... I'll be out of the loop for a couple of days doing civvy time at the UN. <laughs> Don't let me down. Mm. Some of these missions do ring a bell. Like, they're conjuring up memories. Deep, deep memories. Long forgotten. Hehehe. <laughs> <laughs> 
Hell yeah. All right. Yes, sir. Affirmative. Wait, let's get these guys moving forward. Right away, sir. A little. Right away, sir. Unit get this guy to deploy. Moving out. New construction options. Unit reporting. This guy out that way. Oh. Oh my god, Grenadier is now. Yes. That's right. Complete. So like some of the units are unique. Like that unit that complete. tank is unique to the Nod team. This unit's this uh, unique to the GDI team. Yes, sir. Uh, but like a lot of the units, like the foot soldiers, and um, oh, yeah. See, we got different. Oh, whoops. <laughs> we got um. New construction options. Oh, we can build a refinery. Nice. Building. Uh, some of the units are changing now. We've got grenadiers. We had um. Construction. The enemy just then had. Oh, here's the um Tiberium. New okay, construction um, My options. build distance is really small. Building. Is that normal? <laughs> I forget what's normal in this game because I played the later games way, way more. Construction complete. New construction options. And then uh oh com center. Building. Yes please. Yeah, so you got engineer, grenadier, and mini gunner. Can I set a waypoint? I can't. This game doesn't have waypoints. <laughs> Holy shit. Ready. Yeah, so now we've got a refiner. Yeah, so part of the thing is I forgot to mention, um, that's another thing, is that Tiberium can be used, like, can be refined into materials. I can't remember exactly how it works, but basically, it's, the Tiberium is actually worth quite a bit. So some, so some people were, like, refining it and using it in, in production stuff. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's like, there we go, now I got a map. See, when you get the comm center, now you can have a map. And silos are needed if you want to store more than a certain amount of money. Complete. I forget how much money is max. But a silo will allow you to have extra money. Uh, I cannot build a war factory yet, so I can't build tanks. Reporting. Let's get these guys out here. Uh, which means I also can't build another refiner. I would get a second refiner going. <laughs> oh, it's so wild to go to the, like, <laughs> this whole view. Uh, yeah. <laughs> the old pixel view. Yeah, see, so he's like depositing into the refinery. And you refine that and it you can use it either... I think either the idea is a Tiberium, much like it can traver, converse anything, convert anything into itself, I have a feeling it can do the reverse as well. It can convert, be converted into other materials. Ready so... Yeah, it's like super valuable. Roger. So people want to harvest it and, and use it for things things and stuff right away, but uh right <laughs> you know it's dangerous because if it's unchecked it uh yes, you know it'll uh, get destroyed sorry you know, the Affirmative. earth will get destroyed i oh, see there's a rocketeers those are guys with rockets basically strong against tanks and the like this guy has better field of view so i prefer to send like these guys out okay My base is not very well defended. <laughs> Hell yeah. Grenadiers really are better at destroying tanks. But, um... You know, when you have just mass... <laughs> mass, uh... Regular units, they do pretty good damage to you. Okay, as, as I thought. Oh, okay. Ah! <laughs> Run! I wish I could repair units, but I cannot. <laughs> the Rocketeers are no match for uh, our foot soldiers with guns. Okay, I want to build some more Grenadiers. I'll just send the Grenadiers by themselves. Let's Grenadier this <laughs> structure here. I can't believe I can't place waypoints. Unit ready. <laughs> I'm a mechanical. I'm a mechanical. I'm a mechanical man. <laughs> that's the music that's playing. See, these guys are useless against other units, other foot soldiers. Oh, let's get this guy. Okay. Let's get these guys over here. They're trying to repair their. Oh, 
See, these guys are much better against uh, the Rocketeers. Okay, look at these Grenadiers over here. Building. Oh, I so desperately want to. <laughs> so desperately want to place a waypoint. Building. Oh my god. Oh my god. There we go. Cool. Um, let's just have a look up here. Oh. I love the. Oh, I love these games. <laughs> Construction complete. You might have heard me saying stuff like that in. like referencing that in earlier, like, episodes and streams and things like that. Because I often reference, like, construction complete. New construction options. <laughs> I think Grenadiers are better against... F oh, right, right. Um, I think Grenadiers are better against foot soldiers than uh, Rocketeers are. Oh my god, their field of view is so poor. There we go. Get this guy. Get down here and destroy that. Yes, sir. Moving out. Affirmative. Waiting. Send these guys Roger. over here. Get like, no, 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 cancel, cancel. On Get hold. like ten of these guys. Cancelled. <laughs> Building. On hold. Cancelled. Ready. ready. Yes. Building. Unit ready. <laughs> I love Unit this shit. Ready. Oh, Unit. it's so good. Building. Affirmative. <laughs> Unit ready. Yes. Unit lost. Yes. Oh? Unit. Where? Ready. Well, I'm gonna get these guys. Uh, actually, Unit. no, I'll get these guys over here Roger. to defend my Building. harvester. Unit. Ready. These guys Unit. to join these guys. Ready. Let's explore Moving above out. here. Moving out. Tanks are better at withstanding the, Unit. uh, the Tiberium. Moving out. They're not immune, but they're, they're better at not dying in Tiberium. You can send a vehicle through Tiberium and it doesn't get too damaged. But foot soldiers get really hurt. Okay, let's... Oh god! Okay. Can we not build ta a tank? Why can't we build tanks? <laughs> Grenadiers are better at tanks. Oh! Okay. Okay, okay. Oh god. Okay. Focus fire. Focus fire. Uh oh. <laughs> completely. Oh my god. Completely surrounded. Um. Okay. Building. Uh oh. They're deploying. Building. A lot of guys. Unit ready. Unit ready. Okay. Building. Our base is under attack. Unit ready. Building. Unit oh, I see. <laughs> it's... Unit ready. Oh, Building. they're deploying their units. Unit ready. Unit lost. Unit ready. Unit ready. Unit lost. Unit ready. Okay, I need to focus Building. all my soldiers together Unit and not ready. get surrounded. Unit lost. Unit ready. Okay. Building. They're attacking me from multiple directions. Unit ready. Okay. By saying back. Oh my god. <laughs> That's the thing, I think the Rocketeers have the most range though of all the foot soldiers. Um. Oopsies. I was gonna send this guy over here. Okay, so we, we've actually done a number of them on their foot soldiers. Moving out. Moving out. Okay. I just want to I want to just uh, map out the area the thing I loved about these games and it was actually apparently a, a design philosophy of this game was that they um, they made sure that you oh hey random civilians um, they designed this game with the idea in mind that you never there's no there's no player cap sorry no unit cap so oh this guy's gonna die no <laughs> okay, get back here Unit ready. Yes. Okay. New Building. forces. Unit ready. Roger. Unit ready. Building. Moving out. Unit. Okay, make these guys ready. number one. Insufficient. Oh, I run out of funds. 
It's alright. My um, harvester will get back soon. <laughs> I have a lot more foot soldiers. Come on, I was gonna say, you can throw grenades up there. He's gonna run. No, no. Oh. Come on, everyone who can stand here. Everyone who can stand here and then shoot it. The, the intelligence of these units is not the best in this game. Okay, these guys who re refuse to shoot at it from a distance. You're gonna go out this way. We'll send you on a little... on a uh, scouting operation. Okay, no, 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 no. Okay, they, they're gonna go right round if they want to attack, so... Come back down here. Oh, this is a random enemy soldier there. Okay, let's join forces with these units out here. Let's uh, get these guys standing here. Unit ready. Building. Unit ready. Okay, attack this. Unit <laughs> ready. Okay, no, he really went away straight away. Uh, okay, now let's go. Let's go the side way. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah, so there's a random, like, village down here with some civilians. Dave and Shelly. <laughs> they have names now? Did they used to have names? I don't remember them having names. Not a problem. Roger. <laughs> I love the noises they make. I know that's them dying. Those are death rattles, but it's just really... Iconic. Such a throwback. Not a problem. Moving out. Moving out. Okay, let's let's just run in and attack. If we all attack, we'll destroy it in no time. Okay, they're not gonna attack me, I'll run ahead. Once again though, I think I think the other thing is like these barricades, the grenadiers can throw over them, but the rocketeers can't Oh never mind. I think you can just attack through. <laughs> just they weren't attacking, so I assumed that Oh, it's like rocketeers can't shoot through it, but the other soldiers, the grenadiers can. No, it's just a <laughs> just they weren't attacking for some reason. I don't need to destroy these. It's just like a matter of pride at this stage. Mercy is for the weak, the song said. Yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm so, oh! That one grenadier on the enemy team. Very. Oh! They destroy my. No, they didn't destroy my harvester. Good. Okay, oh. Ooh, they did a number on my. Units. Ready. Ready. <laughs> Ready. I love. I just love going back to low graph, low graphics mode. Every now and then, so cool. I just got an achievement: mission casualties. Yeah, <laughs> that's me. So that's, yeah, that's their barracks. Oh, so it does look different. Oh, no, no. Check this. Destroy their barracks. Quickly, before they build more units. There we go. <laughs> okay. Let's, let's attack their construction yard so they can't build another barracks. <laughs> there we go. Nice. Well, I'm out of. I'm completely out of money, but it's all good. We have one. <laughs> Hell yeah. I think there's still another. Um. I don't actually need to destroy this. I just needed to go around destroying the sand sites. 
see, see poor civilians like pop out of the pop out of the buildings. Does it say who he is? This is Joe. But Joe shoots at you, so he's got like a single pistol. The the civilians who pop out of those ve uh, buildings, they um, they technically can still you can still win with one of those guys, but you have to be good with him. Yeah, <laughs> that one guy has to be real good with his pistol. Yeah, so this is the last thing I actually have to destroy. Insufficient funds. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> I don't need funds. I've won. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Alright. Yeah. We won't worry about the cutscenes and stuff from now on. Okay, wait, wait. Can I just exit? Mini mini. There we go. Okay. Alright. And there's a bonus gallery. I'm assuming it's all the footage. We might have missed one of the cutscenes, because um Uh I I just skipped through the end there. Uh but yeah, that was that was a taster of Command and Conquer, the original Command and Conquer. The first in a series of games that I freaking love, and I really hope if they're gonna if they're in the business of remaking right now, I hope I really and actually even even has Westwood Studios at the top there. I really hope. Oh, because it's actually Oh I think I knew that already, but I just forgot. Petroglyph. Like, Westwood Studios was the original studios who made Command and Conquer right through to Yuri's Revenge. The Command and Conquer games that came after Euros Revenge were made just by EA. Because they're one of the studios. Westwood was one of the studios that got, like, consumed and then killed by EA. Uh, <laughs> Petroglyph is a studio that was... This the studio down here. Is a studio that was basically formed from former Westwood Studios members. And they went on to make their own stuff. You know, they made, like, um... One of the games I really loved from them, or really enjoyed, even though I suck at, from them was, um, Grey Goo. It's another RTS game, it's really interesting. But it looks like Petroglyph was involved, if not was like spearheading the remake of the old Command and Conquer games. And I really hope they continue when they remake the later Rid uh, Red Alert games and, and uh, Tiberium games, because I just, they're my childhood. <laughs> they're like a huge portion, like of all the games I've played in my life, Command and Conquer Red Alert 2 Yuri's Revenge is probably the game I've played the most of any game ever. So, yeah. That's, isn't that mind-blowing? <laughs> even though I suck at RTS games, it's probably the game I played the most of all time. And it's the game, one of the games that got me into modding. Because I mod, I used to mod Red Alert 2 using um, a, a toolkit called Tibid. And it was basically, type, it stood for Tiberium Editor, but it, it worked on Red Alert games. I used to mod Red Alert 2 and I, I would do all sorts of silly additions and stuff to the teams and and yeah I, I used to love trying stuff out and that was like me tipping my dipping my toes in the waters of modding which would eventually lead me to make the portal mod and get into like game develop more game development stuff so yeah i'm really excited to see i really hope eh, <laughs> i really hope that they go and remake or remaster the red alert games the later the later command and conquer games as well because i'd be really keen to see that uh, but yeah, next episode, we're going to do this again, but next episode we're going to play Red Alert instead. Uh, so I hope you guys look forward to that. But until then, <laughs> if you like what you saw, hit like. If you want to see more from me, then subscribe! Thank you so much for watching. And until next time. <laughs>